these are moments and opportunities that as competitors, I think we all live for and look forward to. You win in these moments because of your execution and preparation, and the people who don't are the ones who look too far ahead. You have to fight and you have to be willing to do the little things to win and win the small battles as well as the big battles. I'm very comfortable in moments where there's a lot of pressure. I feel very comfortable in moments where it causes you um, to win and, and being a championship moment. That's what I ask for. Um, that's what I enjoy. Um, that's what I thrive in. Embracing the fact that your training all year long is for the bad moments and not the good ones. The good ones will happen naturally. The bad ones are what you prepare for every day. Oh, embrace the moment. Don't get caught up in the moment. If we can compete and we can compete together, um, I think that's a, a really good start to building a championship team. You're not working on proving anybody wrong, you always work on just proving yourself right. Those people are champions, regardless if they win at the end of the day or not. Not ready to be done. Not ready to go home. And we owe them the ass for help each other on offense, help each other on defense, and let's communicate at a high, high level starting now. This is a day to be great. Everyone made multiple sacrifices to be here today, to make this moment great. This is your time. Yeah, you guys are ready. You guys are ready. You can sense it, you can feel it. Hey, and again, it's, it's time. All right, so it's time to go compete. The world's gonna stop for a period of time, and you can take advantage of that and be victorious. There's been beauty in the struggle because of how hard uh, it's been to make sure everybody's on the same page. Make sure we are setting the tone as the aggressors early. Read the situation when it's time to pull it back. Constantly put their five minute ball screens. Everybody who's in this league is here for a reason. The team that is uh, most prepared and can handle the moment will be victorious. We're all built for this moment. We're all here for a reason. We have to make sure that we dominate. Be in the moment. From here, from now until the end of this conversation, from the end of the conversation to warm-ups, just focus on what is ahead of you at all times. One through 12, let's get it. Guard your man, stop him, and let's win this game today. All right. Together on three, one, two, three, together. We are in the nation's capital, is getting set for the first of two semifinals in the CEBL. And here we go. AJ Davis's mom is in attendance here, and his mom is happy with that. Down low for Alexander. Alexander, left hand is no good, hits the rim. Leo, stop settling. 14 to six, eight point lead for the River Lions. Nice fake by Davis. His jumper, yeah, bring it up, folks. Hands! Here's Anderson, dead center three. Can't connect, loose ball. The boss throws it up, and the throw down by EJ Onu. Right, let's go! Juricic, the corner. JB Mukama, no. He drew long. Working on Anderson, shoots over top of him and hits it! And Elijah Mitru Long doing a little dance. Here's Teddy Allen blocked there. 
by E.J. Onu. Fresh 14 here for Scarborough. But there you see that tenacious defense from Niagara. And then eventually Chapman gets it for two. Walden Mullings. Oh, Walden Mullings. Maybe a tad too fancy there. Isaiah Mike from downtown rattles it down. Look, look, look. At the end of plays, you have to go to the basket. Everybody has to go back. Fade away, long threes are not cutting it. Put pressure on the paint. Let's go. Stay solid. It's all on this end. It's on this end. Stick to the game plan. Let's go. Again, another turnover. Walden Mullings. He's looking for it. They go to the ground. Isaiah Mike on the drive. He'll go to the line. Scarborough's intensity in this second quarter has been picked up. Chapman. Chapman trains a corner three. Oh, and Ahmad tried to throw down the jam there. Came up short, and that's going to be a foul against Scarborough. Isn't that nice when a point guard can attack the rim like that? Solid. We're going to get back in this game. Be clear. Now it's a one-point lead, River Lion. Scarborough that comes almost all the way back. E.J. Onu from downtown. Two seconds remaining. Chapman puts it up and clanks it. Well, wow, tale of two quarters. The team that's been the most intense has won the quarter. Come get it. Here we go, here we go, here we go. What was the difference between the start of the game and the rest of the first half? Energy and intensity. Be in the moment. Nothing is going to come easy. You have maximum one and a half games of basketball left together. Do not, for one second, take it for granted. We're right back in this game. This is a war, this is a fight. We defend at the highest possible rate. We will win this basketball game. You can destroy a team off of energy, togetherness, and toughness. Don't take a moment off. We just allowed a team to come back by doing nothing. You have to say no fing way. You can't say, like, oh man, no. Do not come back in here at the end of the game and did not give your all. Play for each other. Let's go. Let's go, man. We're the first five, bro. To the first five. Let's go. We let them back in the game. Let's put them away now. Maybe we'll call the first time out. Let's finish the game off. We're where we need to be. Play for championship right here. Outlet pass. Here comes Walden Mullings. And just puts it in as Harris got back there on D and almost blocked it. Onu downtown, and EJ Onu was heating up as well. Make sure it's one shot and done. The inbounds. Allen working on Ahmad, loses the handle on it. And then Niagara give it right back. Here's Robertson for three, drills it big time with authority. Here's Robertson again, lofting up a three. Do not touch him, folks. You might get third degree burns. He's on fire. Ahmad on the drive, puts it up, puts it away. Stars are shining here right now on both sides. Mitru Long on the drive, blows by Chapman. Can't finish though. And that's gonna do it for three quarters of play. Don't worry about the score. Play the scout. You've got to turn this around. All right? 62, 56 in favor of Scarborough. Here's Ahmad putting up a three and knocking it down big time. Mullings contesting every loose ball. And there is Chapman, and he has got the red hot hand right now. Zip away, zip away. Davis gets double teamed, gets knocked down. And that's Scarborough ball. Cash Robertson, deep three, hits it. Davis, in Niagara, they needed that. They use a foul, a tactical foul, to get themselves into Elam. Let's go, come on, come on. This is about winning the game. That's all this is about right now. Let's go, everything you got, everything you got. Robertson puts it up, banks it in. There you go, right on cue, Joe. Oh! Onu on the perimeter trying to defend. Isaiah Mike launches it. They get the rebound. Harris trying to slam it down. Jalen Bad Harrison pulls up, looking for three, gets the bounce. Here's Chapman. Oh! 
What a drive to the 10. Garbrough, three points away. An expansion team looking to get to the CEBL final. Now they are one point away. Ahmad, scoop off the glass, no good. Here comes Scarborough. Can they punch their ticket to the final? Yes, they can! Chapman with the tip. And the Scarborough Shooting Stars in their first year in existence in the CEBL are off to the championship game on Sunday. Man, they were led by their leader, Jalen Harris. And there's that Scarborough team off to the final on Sunday. One more, one more, one more, one more.